Hey, hello guys, welcome back. I hope you guys are doing very well and happy Dashera and happy Navratri to all of you who belongs to India. So uh, this is an announcement video and here I have launched a new course on Azure Data Factory. Okay, so if you do not know what is Azure Data Factory, this is the number one or we can say top five resources available in the Azure Data Engineering you know if you are someone who is very aspiring to become an Azure Data Engineer then Azure Data Factory is one of the most important resource right so Azure Data Factory is kind of ETL tool okay and as well as the orchestration tool in Azure so I have launched this course and let's talk about you know what is covered in this course so first of all, you know, uh, this is a master in Azure Data Factory interview questions and as well as the end to end project. OK, so see if you are someone who who know about uh, Azure a little bit, who know about the Azure Data Factory a little bit, let's say what is link service, what is, you know, uh, what, what is pa parameters, what is schedule triggers, what is X, Y, Z things, right? So you can take this course if you do not know all these stuff in detail I would suggest to take out my free course of basics of Azure Data Factory and then jump to this course although I have covered everything from the sketch till the end in this course also but if you are if if you want to you know go go with first very basic then I would suggest to go and check out that course now we can skip all this stuff right and you can see course curriculum till now I have I have covered almost four hours of content, 18 sessions, 18 sessions means 18 videos have been uploaded in this course in, on my portal. So first module is introduction to Azure Data Factory. Here I have covered what is Azure Data Factory, what is the need of Azure Data Factory, as well as then, you know, set up Azure Data Factory from the beginning, you know, from the beginning, I, you just want, you just want one subscription. After that, I have I have covered everything right uh, how how to create a resource group what is you know what is subscriptions what is tenant and all other stuff I have covered in this in this course right and like likewise I as, as I said that you know I have covered integration and time link service data set and triggers then set up git in Azure data factory after that in module one I am covering you know all the questions all very basic questions till the advanced question right in in this in this uh, you know in this uh, module let's say you know set up Azure Data Lake Gen 2 set up Azure Data Lake Gen 2 part 2 set up integration and time key vault build first copy activity Gen 2 Gen 2 to Gen 2 using access keys and SAS token copy activity add columns if you want to add some extra column while you are copying the data from one place to another and how we can limit the rows in the files copy activity you can you 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 can see this example see I have covered almost everything of the copy activities see wildcard folder file names list of files using use, the use of binary data set type of copy behavior fault tolerance data consistency verification create link service using service principle create and then you can see I have covered also how we can create a how we can create a link service using manage identity then I have changed the scenario I am copying the data from SQL table to the blob storage or gen 2 or vice versa so I have created some videos for now you know create SQL table using you know create SQL table link service copy activity SQL table to ADLS copy activity data lake gen 2 to SQL table insert and upset when you want to perform an insert insert when you want to perform an upset then fault tolerance example in copy activity that like the practical knowledge likewise I, I will be uploading more videos in it ideally I am uploading like two to three hours of content so basically by end of this week or we maybe you know within seven to eight days or ten days maximum ten days this module one will be covered and if you practice all these questions by yourself right or even though if you just watch this video I am like 90 percent sure that you will crack the interview now if you want to master date in this Azure Data Factory then you can go and check out this uh, module 2 so in this module 2 I'm I'm going to cover the end-to-end -end project maybe you know I will I, I will create a two or three three projects but it is depend on the length of the project or on the size of the project if 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 I'm getting a very you know big use case then I will create up only one project like I had created for one of the uh, for one of the course but if I'm getting a, a small small use cases then I will create two to three projects but that is around two to three hours of content you know in one project minimum minimum content minimum content or duration will be like two to three hours right 
सो आई मस्ट से इफ यू आर लैकिंग माई कंटेंट राइट इफ यू हैव लव माई यू नो डेटा बेस सीरीज इफ यू हैव लव माई पाइथन सीरीज एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू बिकम आई एज ओ डेटा इंजीनियर और एज ओ इफ यू वॉन्ट टू बी अ मास्टर इन डेटा फैक्ट्री देन आई एम डेफिनेटली श्योर टू चेक आउट दिस कोर्स एट लीस्ट इन्वेस्ट सम मनी यू नो दिस इज द कोर्स प्राइस इज वेरी लेस इफ यू गोइंग टू अ लाइव क्लासेज एंड अदर स्टफ यू विल यू विल बी चार्ज टू मच बट दिस कोर्स इज वेरी यू नो अफोर्डेबल प्राइस आई एम अवेलेबल इन अफोर्डेबल प्राइस सो यू कैन एटलीस्ट एट लीस्ट चेक इट यू नो आई 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 मस्ट से दैट यू नो यू हैव टू गो ओवर हेयर एंड जस्ट चेक द कंटेंट टेस्ट इज योर चॉइस राइट एंड विश यू अ वेरी हैप्पी दशहरा एंड प्लीज इन्जॉय योर डेज एंड थैंक यू बाय बाय